In this video, we're going to show you how to invite the tenant for online payments. So you want to go to the worksheet tab at the top and click on property worksheet. You'll end up on this page here. And next to the tenant's name, you'll see a green button with a white arrow in it. You want to click on that and you'll get a drop down menu. The first option is online payment. And to invite the tenant for online payments, you want to click on this green online payments button. We get a pop up and we can see the tenant's name, the property address, the tenant's email, and we also see the lease terms. We see the monthly amount, the due date, and the fixed term dates. And you can also edit the lease right here as well if you need to. At the bottom, we have the payment settings. So the first option is allowing one-time payment. That means a tenant can make a payment at any time. If you want the tenant only on auto withdrawal, you want to uncheck that. The next option right here is asking who is going to cover the transaction fees. If you want the tenant to cover the transaction fee, you want to go ahead and check mark that. But if you want to cover the transaction fee, you want to leave it unchecked. Next, I'll click on continue. And now we can see the email that will be sent to the tenant. So right here is our default message that will be sent and you can customize this. You can add more to the email and down at the bottom is the special link that the tenant will click on to set up. And you can also copy yourself on the email by check marking that. And all you do is click on setup and send invite and the tenant will receive an invitation to set up for online payments.